Hi, my name is Ahmed. Uh, this is the Pi door world I'm working on. Here's the LCD showing that internet has been set up. So first of all, when it turns on, it checks for internet. If it does, it means you can tweet, Instagram, Facebook, email, send a text, that sort of thing, uh, when someone rings your doorbell. If it isn't, it will say internet's not set up. And if you haven't set up internet, it will just act as a doorbell. It will just say ding dong and nothing else. So right now there's a huge jumble of wires. These will be cleared up. I plan to mount this LCD on top of this Raspberry Pi. So it sits on top, flat on top, with these pins. Like that. So right now I've controlled this with a push button right here. So right there, there's a push button. Yeah, and right, uh, it's, it's a manual push button, so in the future I'll be looking into getting a Bluetooth one. When I press the button, it should say ding dong on the speaker, but I haven't set that up yet. It will display on the LCD the time and the date it was last pressed. So if you go home after it was pressed, you can know when someone pressed it, and if you miss somebody. So it will keep displaying that until the next time it's pressed. So after a minute, which is now, I press it, it'll say 32, and it's accurate to the internet's time, so you won't go wrong there. This will now send, right now, program to send a tweet, and, no, sorry, it'll send an email and a text. It'll sending a text to the phone that's recording now, so you won't get the message. Now, if I open up the email that gets sent, this is sent there. If I open up the email there, you'll get, hi, somebody knocks on your door at that time. And at that date, have a great day. I'll be looking into getting a picture. I haven't set the camera up. Looking to get a picture to display here, right here, um, in the email or as an attachment. Uh, you wanted to know about cost. This LCD is about twenty pounds. The Pi is about twenty pounds, and these are the costs right now. Uh, I'll be looking into a speaker and a button, but this Pi, when when this LCD went on top of the Pi, will have a very low profile. So the Pi right now is uh, 8 centimeters by 6 centimeters, and when it's on top, it's about 3.5 centimeters. Um, if we show it, it's probably disconnect. It will disconnect. Yeah. So this is how it will, what it will look like. We have the Pi there, and the LCD, and it, will, and it will be on top of each other in like a case. And you'll press the doorbell, uh, wireless doorbell, which I haven't set up yet either. You can connect it with a smartphone app. Uh, I'm working on a web app, so like a web interface. So you type in the IP address of the Pi, or like a web address, and you go into settings for the Pi. I'm thinking about putting, um, I'm thinking about putting settings for the Pi. So if you want to put your number in, so tell you the text, uh, put your email address, put your Twitter account, little the settings and enable and disable them. So let's say if you want to tweet, but not a text, that sort of thing. So yeah, that simple interface, turn them on and off and put your number and your Twitter account. Uh, yeah, I'll be looking to get an Twitter inter account. Um, so it'll send a live video or even audio. I'll start with audio, then video. Uh, I'll also be looking at sending a screenshot of the person outside. Send it to Twitter, send that to your email. Alright, thank you. Bye.